All right, welcome human to ETC Tutorials. So I wanted to make a quick video showing the project that I have been working on and basically why I haven't uploaded uh, many videos in a while and more specifically why I haven't uploaded any tutorials in a while. Uh, so this is a project that I have been working on for kind of a while. Um, I kind of decided to put all of my other projects on hold until I get this project finished uh, because you know I only have so much time in the day and I really got to limit uh, what I work on. And for now, I've just decided that this is what I'm going to work on. And this project is going to end up being a beginner tutorial series on Unity 3D, Blender, and GIMP, which is uh, all three of those programs are free and they're all available on PC and Mac. Um, so this beginner tutorial series will teach you uh, everything from the ground up. So there's going to be no previous experience uh, required to follow this tutorial series. So unlike my other tutorial series, the FPS1 tutorial series, that was an intermediate tutorial series that kind of required you to have a little bit of Unity uh, knowledge before you actually jumped into the tutorials. Um, whereas this series is going to take you from the very beginning, like before you even have Unity installed and before you even know what Unity is, uh, this series will teach you everything that you need to know uh, along with Blender and GIMP. It'll both it'll teach you those programs too and how to make these th three programs work with each other and to create an awesome video game. So it's not like your first video game is going to be Pong or something super boring and simple like that. My goal is to make a beginner tutorial series where you actually get to learn how to make something really awesome. Uh, so what's going on on the screen right now looks pretty complicated, but if you break it down into steps, it's actually pretty simple. Um, so the character was modeled and animated in Blender, and then all of the animations are strung together through Mechanim. So Mechanim is going to be a part of the tutorial series. Um, and then there is some leaning uh, going on when the uh, player changes directions and uh, starts running and stops running. It has a little bit of a lean to give it some momentum and some weight to it. Uh, that's actually just some simple vector math uh, that I will teach. Um, and the uh, player is controlled with a character controller. Uh, so I'm going to teach how to use that. Um, and then the camera, you can control or you can let it just be automatic. Uh, and then another cool feature, let me just run, run over to this block and move the camera. So you can see the camera will actually move forwards towards the player uh, to make sure that the camera can always see the player so that uh, you don't like get in the way and not, or so that an object can't get in front of the camera and block you from being able to see the player. Uh, and then you can sign, or you can just uh, seamlessly switch to controlling the camera on your own. Um, and then uh, there are mouse and keyboard controls. So I was playing uh, with an Xbox 360 controller. So uh, just so you can see, Xbox 360 controller, change the camera with the uh, thumbstick. Uh, and then now I am switching over to mouse and keyboard. I am now playing with a mouse and keyboard. Um, so I'm just playing with WASD um, and using the mouse to uh, move the camera. Um, so, yep, it is a pretty fluid camera system. And you don't even, I'm going to take my hand off the mouse and just show. Uh, the camera will automatically follow your player and you don't need to adjust the camera in order to get good gameplay. Um, so it looks pretty complicated, but it's actually not too complicated once you break it down into steps. Um, let's see what other cool things are going on. Um, well, that's basically the whole, uh, the basics of everything that's going on in this tutorial series. Um, so this tutorial series is going to take a lot of time and I really want to be able to uh, produce this tutorial series at really, really high production quality and really spend the time to make this tutorial series really, really awesome. So in order to do that, I have been heavily considering uh, turning this into a Kickstarter project. And I've been trying to work out some details uh, with that and just studying Kickstarter uh, just trying to figure out how Kickstarter works, how I can implement uh, implement Kickstarter uh, into this project. 
um, and I think it will be really cool, and I don't want to release any details about the Kickstarter, uh, just because I do have some plans in place, but my plans keep on changing because I keep on uh, discovering new things about Kickstarter, um, so I want to basically just get all of that ready before I announce any official details about the Kickstarter, but I just wanted to let everybody know that I'm going to be doing a Kickstarter. Um, so yeah, uh, so I guess I will do more updates in the future and show how this game progresses and hopefully uh, somewhat soon get this Kickstarter project going uh, so that hopefully I can get some funding and uh, spend the real time needed to make this the best possible tutorial series probably on YouTube, especially for uh, within making games in Unity. Um, I'm really excited about this project. I think it's going to be really awesome. Uh, so stay tuned for more updates. And uh, let me get my mouse in the right place. So until my next episode, I will see you later and keep making games.